stay to the end of this video if you want to see what is underneath this hat. Oh my god. Hey everyone and welcome back to another video. I'm doing another hair one which I said I wouldn't ever do but this is the Blonde It Up um, by Clairol and I thought it says on there it lightens up to five shades so I've used these pre-lighteners before this is meant to have no bleach in it whatsoever mm, I don't really think I believe that but anyway I've used these before where it's been like okay I'm gonna lighten my hair with a pre-lightener and they've worked or at least give me some sort of yellow or orange you know take something away so this is me just quickly brushing my hair I've got very thick frizzy hair naturally this is before I've straightened it anything like that there's no point. I'm tying some of my hair up because it's really, really thick. And I'm gonna start spreading some on, but I don't spread a lot on at first because looking at the bottle and how much hair I have, I never take that in, into consideration. I always just look at it and think, I've got short hair, it's fine. But really, I've got really thick hair. So I was a bit cautious and thought maybe I need two bottles of this. So I just put it on until it was kind of like wet but not soaking and started moving up the top of my head then once it was all covered I then got the rest of it which was half a bottle still third half a bottle I decided to use all of that and just really soak the rest of my hair and get it completely covered I have been trying to avoid the roots throughout this process but it never ever happens. I always get root hair lays on top of other hair and then it just goes into the root. So I'm not, I'm just, well, if you look at any of my previous hair videos, you'll know I am not the best at this, but we're going with it. So all completely covered and saturated with all this product. It doesn't smell couldn't find my comb so I'm using a hair clipper comb on the end just to sort of spread it through a little bit before I then wrap it with a shower cap tuck it all in try and get some heat in there hoping for the best and I'm gonna stick a nice towel perfect color choice to stick on my head and keep the heat in I'm somewhat concerned because my roots are looking a little ginger but I've made cheese toasties I'm starving and I'm gonna eat them first but speak to the light mmm hey hi I should wash it off once I've eaten it's been over an hour so I'm just gonna wash it off and what will be will be Still soaking wet but you can see it's more brown and that's wet Bam. <laughs> okay it's still wet but just going to absorb how bad this is and then decide what to do going forward I'm not gonna stress it So, does this work on box dyed black hair dye hair? No, definitely not. I wouldn't recommend it to anybody. Natural hair, yes. I would probably do one box and then do another. My hair doesn't feel damaged. Um, I've just got very thick bushy hair. I have all my life, doesn't matter what I do. Um, it just grows fr frizzy, is that the word, frizzy? Um, and now I'm in two minds, what do I do? Do I foil bleach from the root all the way down in very tiny sections and go through the orange stage or do I put dark on it and just be done with it? But that's the whole point of doing this is that I don't want to be dark anymore. So a little bit unsure at the moment as to what to do. My frizzy bush. Um, yeah, I'm not sure, but do not put this on box dyed hair it probably says that on there but i never read them i'm just like oh, give it a go 
I know what's the worst that could happen this is the worst that can happen um doesn't smell really bad washes out really easily cut the water color came out like a urine color and yeah I think I'm just gonna probably risk it what's the worst that could happen I could go short again or I can go too orange and end up going brown but I'll do something Right now it's going to be a hat situation until I make my mind up. But thank you so much for watching this video. Please don't go out and buy this if you've got dyed hair like this. And um, yeah, because you just waste your money and then you could end up with a root situation like me. But um, yeah, it's only a, it's under six six pounds, and I won't be using it again unless <laughs> unless I was like blonde and I wanted to go a bit blonder, which is the purpose of it, not a black box dye. But anyway. Thank you all for watching, see you all in my next one and let's see what colour we can go next.